demonstrating an ACL ligament reconstruction in the knee using a graft. There are three bones that meet to form the knee, the femur or the thigh bone, the tibia or the shin bone, and the patella or the kneecap. These bones are held together by strong rope-like tissues called ligaments. One of the ligaments is called the ACL, anterior cruciate ligament, which is in the middle of the knee joint and helps stabilize the knee in front to back and rotational motions. A common injury to the ACL is a sprain or a tear. First, the surgeon places the drill guide on the femur and locks it in place. The drill guide is placed against the bone. The drill begins drilling through the femur from outside of the joint to the inside of the joint. After removing the guide, the drill sleeve is tapped into the femur. Then the blade at the end of the drill pieces are opened into the cutting position and drilled into the bone, creating a hollow space in the bone. The drill is stopped when it meets the tip of the drill sleeve and is removed. A suture is passed through the drill sleeve and through the previously created space. The drilling and suture passage steps are then repeated in the tibia. These sutures are used to pass the pre-sutured graft that will ultimately replace the ligament. The suture with the button in the femur helps pull the graft through the femur. Additional sutures are placed on the graft, and then the sutures from the tibia pull the graft into the tunnel in the tibia. A button is added to the sutures on the tibia and then tightened. The button on the femur is also tightened. The remaining tibia sutures are tied to the bottom and the tails are cut, completing the repair.